Hello and welcome back to Orwell, episode two. I didn't even get to read the name. That was very quick. All right. Welcome back. I hope you don't mind if we get started right away. We have tons of work ahead of us. Met with my superiors and they wish to continue with the test case. They believe in the capability of Orwell to handle this and of you, of course. My superiors agree with me. Based on the information you have already extracted, the activist group known as Thought is worth investigating. Seems this Goldfells is an important member of Thought, so we now have clearance to consider them as a target person. Now that Goldfells is a target person, there, there may be new data chunks available in documents you've already accessed. Don't forget to go back and recheck your sources. Yeah, I mean, I got that yesterday when we were, when we were looking at it. So, uh, We have no idea that that's actually his picture, but... So we know he likes this piece. Letter, all right. We are, we are right, it seems. And we go to the nation, 93. An immigrant, well, you guys are racist as fuck, so... Created this blog. An activist group the same name as this blog. If Goldfells is the one who created this blog, perhaps he founded or even is, was the leader of this of the activist group. Or it could be a copycat. I mean, it could be this person here. Um, that was five years ago, though. Let's see. Connection between Vaunt and bomb bombing is evident. Let's see. Created with pure malevolence. I mean, that's... Um, okay. Timelines and Rosen announced cooperation. Internet billionaire... Who cares? Um, not relevant to the surveillance all that much. Heavy rainstorms. Uh, it just looks like a weather report. All right. Captionize only could garner the attention on thought as a group and what we stand for. It seems my ambition was once again too much. After one and a half years recruiting two of my students and uh, three demonstrations like the one I held at Freedom Plaza. All right, I mean, that's relevant. Three demonstrations. More interesting might be that two students seem to be involved. Okay, halt active engagement. Active engagement means still an interesting fact. My students, so he's a professor at Stelgen, probably wouldn't advocate for bombing his own university either. Yeah, what now, Stelgen, the same Stelgen where a bomb just exploded. Do you know what I think about coincidences? I won't repeat it. So far, the evidence suggests that Goldfels was a prominent lecturer at Stelgen and some of his students became involved in thought. Did he like recruit them for his cause? We need to identify the students, see who else is involved with the group. I see high aim might well be the cause for all the events of the past months more than any, anyone else if I feel responsible. These are not really conflicts, I would say. And that is not how I would read that text. Reacting with hatred and anger? No, that's kind of the opposite of what he's saying. Please reconsider. Guy Hurt there was only a goddamn cop. They had it coming for, for long. Well, we should probably figure out who this is. 
the fact that it's not tagging that is I mean I guess it's maybe not directly relevant but suspected was arrested in her flat she willingly opened the door and cooperated with the arresting officer after having the warrant announced and her rights read to her This is nothing, it seems like. Oh, here we go. I can't reference any of this. Uh, best public dining hall. Well, I think that's relevant. Oh, here we go. Abraham Goldfells. Offered professorship in the field of media ethics at Stelgen. Sadly retired in fall of 2016. Notice the bombing location is closely connected to thought. There could be a pattern emerging. I mean, not really. They're all... Thought has held three demonstrations, yet there have only been two bombings, which might imply... It doesn't imply shit. You're reaching. Definitely a shot in the dark, but we absolutely need to do everything we can to prevent another attack. Take a clue close at the past of each member with thought. Find out the location. I mean, I'm trying, but you keep interrupting me. All the demos they have held that might yield a hint. All right, well, another photo in here. Journalist at Der Reporter. Chairman of the Global Media Ethics Congress. Just the average on the mill terrorist trait. No, that, what? What kind of reading is that? It's a whole lot of information about the skull fells, yet the only one other page could be indexed. Very strange indeed. I think the next course of action should be look for other people in this thought group, like the students you mentioned. Author of the book titled, I, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, I don't think he's a suspect. He might be related to the suspect. Like, obviously, he had an influence on somebody, and then they fractured off, probably. He literally wrote the book. Um, first suspect in connection with assaults arrested. list media department this is a lot of pages to go through recognize any of these names oh okay so these are the list of students but we don't have any oh wait a minute um, he retired fall 2016 so earlier semesters media Um, I mean, he's not on the list, though. Here's one. All right. List of students. So, Juliet was one of his students. Seen this name before, haven't we? Yes. Yeah, I did, dude. You don't have to explain it to me. I was looking at it 20 minutes ago. Oh, 
Authorization to invest, Mr. Carrington. Okay. Why is it sending me to the homepage again? Like there's new stuff there. Your assistant at Rosen Tech. Well, just do the thing automatically. You know what I mean. Well, Rosen is working with the like Facebook analog media company thing. What's it called? Timeline? Okay, so they're not... Wait, no, this is... Hold on. Mary Bly. Okay, that's somebody else. Juliet Carrington is one of the new people she knows. Not so keen on going out late night. Um, is that relevant? I don't know. These are all very, very iffy pieces of information. Engaged in torture? What kind of... No. Is it going to force me to pull, put that in because it's in blue instead of in yellow? Okay, she's got family. Come on. Banana nut muffins. Very relevant. Favorite color is red. Dude, fuck off. If you fail to prevent the next assault due to your processing random data, I won't be taking the fall. Well, your your is yours is the thing that's highlighting this shit. There's an active bond threat right now. Can you please focus on that? Oh, fuck you. Parents. Further confirmation of her studies and her band career when she was single again. All right, so let's go back to her timeline. When did she break up? Okay, so further confirmation they were just meeting for the first time and that she was protecting her. so much about politics now. All right, so that's slightly relevant. First Miss Watergate now hers is some sort of brainwashing going on. I mean, I'm why are we not looking into Harrison? He seems like the instigator. Um, no use of put, throwing stones at poor men and women. Uh, why am I still looking at the attendees list? Okay. Media. Uh, here's another one of his classes. I expect we're going to find... Oh, here's the... Well, I mean, yes, but... Okay, I got to hit other things first then. You told me not to put these things in, so... Are you just going to bully me for putting the things in that I don't think are actually relevant? Um, all right, well.
All right, not particularly relevant, but what's marked as new? Rosentech. Okay, yeah, we know she worked there. Um, Ten Commandments, any vision is valuable. Software can solve any problem. Embrace vision. Open-mindedness, transparency, stay in touch. Synchronous over asynchronous communication. Think about your response. Okay, this is very PR bullshit. Um, okay. The listener will also track incoming and outgoing telephone calls of numbers you have added. All right. Is this actually going to be audio? Ah, okay. I see. This doesn't necessarily imply that she lives with her parents. I mean, I feel like this is relevant as a as a non-terrorist stance. I expect this is going to be relevant. Really, you're not going to highlight that. All right. I mean, I guess I'll throw these in. Innocuous, but we know that she actively dislikes going out. People are truly creatures of heaven. Maybe she really does want to go out, but this seems a little odd. What is she really doing? That's needlessly suspicious. Um, gotta find her parents' address. Well, they've got their personal website thing, so that shouldn't be too hard. Funny, this is right around the corner from where I live. Wait, did you name your kids April and May? Really? And then June. And then Juliet. Oh, come on. Okay, so where, where do we have a timeline? We still don't know when she broke up with who. Was she dating Harrison or something? I'm trying to figure out how... Now I'm metagaming, trying to figure out when, uh, when we get to see about Harrison. What am I missing from here? It's still tagged. Is it really going to force me to do the torture thing? That's incredibly dumb. But it feels like everything else is mostly stalled out. I already looked at this, right? Did I not scroll far enough? 
Uh, oh, do I need to... Oh, come on. Why... So it's going to make me do this? Yeah. All right, there we go. Harrison O'Donnell, yes, we've seen that name connected to Miss Watergate. I'll report this right away. Authorized to consider Harrison O'Donnell target person. Now there's some more work for you. Congrats. Harriet, Harrison and Juliet, those must be Abraham Goldfell's students within thought. Well done. Okay. Before we get into researching Harrison further, uh, I'm going to cut here and we'll come back for that. See you guys then.